Hello traders, good afternoon. Um, today I want to do a very short video to tell you about our group. So the topic of this video will be the best Forex trading group or the best trading group in the world. And I'm going to tell you why we have the best trading group in the world. So this is about the group. This is not about analysis or, or anything in specific. So if you want to know about our group, and what we do in the group, you can continue to watch. If you don't want to know about our group and what we do in the group, you may want to leave right now, right? Because we're not, I'm not going to be doing any analysis in there. If you don't know me, if you don't know, my name is Anil Mangal, by the way. And if you've never seen any of my videos, please go to my YouTube channel uh, and you will find me there. And there are hundreds of videos there that you can watch to know what I do, right? We do wave analysis. So. Let me go straight into what, what I want to tell you about today. I want to tell you about our group because there are many, many questions that have been asked on my uh, on the comments of the group. Where am I? What am I doing? What is the group doing? So what I, what I, I have been doing for the last couple of months is streamlining our group. So I can tell you we were in Slack. We moved from Slack to Facebook Workplace. And I personally did an interview with every single trader in my group that moved over from Slack to Workplace. So that's about 500 interviews I did with every single one of my traders. I wanted to know where they, where, what's their level of trading, how much success they're making, what they would like to see the group be like, how they would, what would we can do to enhance their trading, so that we can input all of that into our group in the on Workplace. So. What is the group about and why it is the best group in the world? So let's go. First of all, let's, let me tell you about the people in the group. We have an amazing group of people. Right now it's about 500 active traders. These are all active traders because personally I've trained about a thousand people or more. Not all of them are active traders. Not all of them participate in the group. Some people just bought the course. They took it, they do whatever they want with it. They were never active in the group. Some people got thrown out of the group because of bad behavior, because of trying to steal stuff and all of that. But active traders in our group now who moved over, who I personally had an interview with, is about 500. So let me tell you what we do in our group. Our group is, is structured in such a way to answer the needs of the traders. What would make you a successful trader? So first I'll tell you what will make you a successful trader, and then I will show you how we structured the group to answer every part of that. So if, you, if you're a trader, the first thing you would need to know, the first thing any trader should do is your analysis. That's the first thing you're going to do, right? That's the number one thing you're going to do. You're going to analyze the chart. You're going to try to figure out where this chart is going to go. So I don't care what the chart is. It doesn't matter. We do, an, and we do a very large amount of, of um, currencies and commodities and stocks and everything. You can see that there's a very, very large list of things we do in our group, cryptos and all of that. So if you're going to trade anything, the first thing you would have to do is have a bias. Is it going to go up or is it going to go down? So for you to have the bias, you will have to do some kind of an analysis. So that's the number one thing you'd have to do. The number two thing you'd have to do, let's say you assume it's going to go up or it's going to go down. You will have a strategy of how you're going to trade that, right? That's your number two thing, a strategy of how I'm going to trade this. Your strategy would include money management, risk management, point of entry, point of stop, and all of that, right? Then the number, the third thing you would have to do is implement that strategy. And this by itself in terms of trading is very important. Implementing your strategy, that's the third thing you're gonna learn to do. And the fourth thing you're gonna learn to do is to manage your trades. Now, what if you thought Euro was gonna go up and you bought Euro? But some, some point along the way you, re, you reanalyze it and you figure out, you know what, this thing is not going. I may have to exit it because it's not going to go. You realize it. You figure out that whatever you're looking at is not working. It's going to, you will have to manage your way out of that trade. Either the trade went in your direction and you manage your way out for less than you intended to go, which means cutting it before it, it because it's not going. Either it's against you and you'll have to cut it so that you don't take your full loss on the stops. But you would have to manage your trades because if you're not managing your trades, you're going to get yourself in big trouble, right? So those are the four, four parts of how you should trade. This is practical trading. These are the four things you would have to do. So what we did is we structured the group to answer these four questions. So what does that mean? I'll use red and I'll write on top of it so you can see. 
For the part of analysis, we teach you how to analyze a chart. We do a six weeks course that teaches you how to analyze charts. That six week course has two weeks of theoretical knowledge, two weeks of practical knowledge, one week of question and answer, and one week where I would I would personally do some some up uh, you know some one on one with you to answer your questions or live trading in the trading room, right? We're restructuring that a little because we're putting I'm putting more accent now on managing your trades, which means that would be two weeks of live trading with me, right? So we're going to restructure, but it's still going to be around six weeks. This is this is kind of a number you don't have to worry much because you have lifetime access to the group, complimentary lifetime access once you join us. So you will be with the group for life and you be a people here who work for four or five years and they're successful, but they still stick around because we have a perfect, you know, a perfect group of people that you can, you know, you can make friends with and you really want to be with just basically even just being in the same group with these people, right? So did that answer your question of analysis? So now that you've learned how to analyze the chart, we teach you some strategies, but we also have a trading room. We have a trading room where we show you how to implement, how to use the strategy and how to implement it. So the trading room that we have answers the rest of your questions. Right? The trading room shows you how to, how to use the strategy, how to correctly implement it, and how to manage your trades. So that is why we're going to be doing two weeks of it. Because once I moved everybody over from, from the old group to the new group, now what I realized is that a lot of traders are very good at the analysis. They know how the strategy works. But when it comes to time to implementing the strategy, there was a, there was a lapse. A lot of traders couldn't click the trade when they should be clicking the trade. Or they click the trade too early or they click the trade too late. Or they're, they're not sure, they're just not sure, they don't click them. And then even those traders who click the trade the problem is, okay, where do I take my profit? Although there is a profit there, should I take the profit out now? It's not going. I'm in the trade. I'm worried what to do. And the management of the trade was a, was a big struggle for even successful traders. I mean, getting the best management strategy, how I'm going to manage this trade, the best way of managing the trade. And that is where I find that the, the, the live trading room was where we did that. So for the last five weeks or the last six weeks, I think, we have been trading live and we've been documenting that. I can't show you that just like I can't show you the group because there's a lot of information there that I don't want to get out, right? Like people's personal email and, and a lot of things and names of people who are running, helping run the trading room. How does the trading room, it works from Asian session starts in the morning. There are a group of successful traders who will help us start open the room in Asian session. I would join them at least once or twice in the Asian session. It would go on to the New York, the London session where I would join them once or twice and the New York session where I would join them once or twice. I try to be in every session at least once, sometimes twice. That's where I give guidance. What do we do in the trading room? We create blueprints. You can bring any trade you, you have, winning or losing trade. And you say, look, I took this trade. Did I manage it correctly? Could I have done something different? And we'll break it up and we will create a blueprint of what you're going to do if you're going to repeat a similar trade. And for every possible situation, we've already created blueprints, which means we know exactly what are the rules are for every single situation. We actually write down rules. This is what these are the rules of how you're going to follow that. But even all of that would be useless if you can't analyze the charts. So the number one thing is you must be able to do an analysis. Now, what type of analysis you want to do, that's up to you. What works for you? But for us, we do wave analysis, and it seems to be working very good for my traders. Now, I don't know if you know me, if you've heard anything about me or not, but there are 500 traders who pretty much like what we're doing, and they are running the trading room. They wouldn't be doing this if they weren't making success. You can't convince 500 people to do something if whatever you're doing is not working. So I'm pretty sure we're doing it well. I may be able to show you the results of last the last week um, thing. Let me see if I can do that without giving exposing too much of the um, uh, information in the group. Let me just see if I can bring that up. Where do I have it? I don't even have it open here right now. I have to go and open that. So there is a link which we were using where everything is documented in a spreadsheet. But basically, it's done by the traders. A trader will come in, he will identify a trade, he will take the trade, they will document it, and then we will follow up on the trade. 
if it's a winning trade, great. If it's a losing trade, we'll, we'll analyze it and decide, did we do everything correct or what we should have done differently? I can tell you most of the losing trades, we cut them shorter. Most of the winning trades, we end up getting the maximum out of them because we are creating blueprints as how to do that. So why am I telling you about my group? Well, because you may want to join us. We're hoping that if, you, if you're a struggling trader and you want to learn, you can join us. And there has been question on, uh, on, on YouTube as to if any of my traders can tell you about our group. A few have answered them, answered you, but they didn't think they give you the full details of what we do. So this is about our group. This is what we do in the group. This is what you get when you join the group, when you take the course. So if you're willing to take the course, we have a course starting in mid-October. You can join it right now. How to join, you send me a Skype message. Let me just type that. Oh, come on, what's happened to this? Let me see, yep, type. And it's M-A-N-G-A-L 457. Send me a Skype message to that Mangal 457. And I will send you the details how to join. So what I found is that there are some traders who couldn't afford to pay the, the full course at one time but would still like to join the group. So we did an experiment la or early last year and we said, okay, you can pay in installments. And some traders took it up and we said, okay, let's go. Most of those traders who took it up are already in the group. Some of them paid out like the second or the third month. Some of them paid like in five months. Most of them who are paying monthly are already gonna pay because the minimum to join monthly doesn't allow you, it, it covers the course within a year. There are some new people who have been joining along the way. So if you want to try it, if you want to see what you can get for a month, you can start by paying an installment for a month if you want, and you see what you get, and then you decide if you want to join. Or you can take the course if you're satisfied with what you get. You can go and check my YouTube video. I did one week. Last week, I did one week of free webinars. You can see what are the quality of the webinars, what we do in there. So what you're getting in the webinars is just my daily analysis. It's not very in-depth because we do them more in-depth in the trading room when we're breaking up the... The, the chart for the trading itself. But what I do in my daily analysis is I give my traders a general view of what they should look for. And then they in turn take that, go into the trading room, break it up, look for that direction, look for the point of entry, look for the point where they're gonna exit the trade, implement it, taking the trade and then manage the trade as it goes. And I join them at least three times a day to give advice on how we're gonna do this and what we'll do. So that's pretty much what I can tell you about our group. Um, I don't know. You may have questions, anything, but I guess by now, if you know me, you, you know what to do. If you don't know me, don't join the group until you have looked at about 20 of my webinars or more, until you have a very clear vision of what I do. Then you should join. I don't think you should join anybody if you don't understand what they're doing, right? Basically. And I've been around for a while, so I think by now you should know the work I do. And where it concerns wave analysis, well, if you see anybody with their name with wave analysis in it, they learn it from me. I'm not, I'm not talking about Elliott wave, I'm talking about wave analysis. Anyone that says he's a wave trader with wave analysis, he learned that from me. I actually coined the term wave analysis because everybody was Elliott wavers. I was an Elliott waver, because, but, but once I started to create the different rules that, that differ from Elliott wave, the way I look at pattern was different from the way Elliott wavers look at it. I decided to change the wave analysis, not Elliott waivers, right? So I'm not an Elliott waiver. I'm a wave analysis person. And you will see there are a lot of wave analysis people out there now because it, the chart is, doesn't follow the rules, all the rules of Elliott wave. Those rules have changed and you have to follow what the chart is doing now. There are patterns that we look at that Elliott waivers do not look at because they don't see things the same way we see it. We look at patterns totally different from the way they look at it. Elliott waivers make forecasts based on ABC, WXY, and the, we, we do forecasts based on the pattern itself. How does the pattern behave? Forget about the labeling of it. How does it behave? And then we label it. We allow the pattern to complete itself. And then we can say, okay, well, this is an ABC, this is a WXY, XZ. This is a more complex pattern. Sometimes a pattern could go on for a year. I could show you one, for example, that we followed for over two years. That is the Aussie New Zealand. We've been following that pattern for two years. So you can label as much as you want, but if you're looking at the pattern itself, the, the structure keeps changing and that is normal. That's absolutely normal. That is why you have to manage the trade. Because if you're looking at one structure now, within the day, that structure could change. Aussie, New Zealand, where is that chart? Daily. 
we have been managing this structure for how many years now? From here all the way to here. And we've been pretty much following every piece as it's developed. And you can see we're still in a correction. And it is still a correction. Look at our forecast. Come here and then go down. See? So we know we know it's a correction for downside because we've been tracking this pattern for a while. So let me end this video there. I don't want to make it too long. If you want to join our group and you like what we do, follow me. Go subscribe to the YouTube videos. Watch all my videos. We do free videos every now and then. I'll probably put out one or two videos every week. I'll try to do that with very short analysis and one or two charts. And if you want to be part of our group, which is an amazing team of people from around the world, you're welcome. Thank you. And bye-bye. I'll end it right there.